Hello everyone, I'm Louise Page, publisher at PLOS. On behalf of PLOS, I want to thank you for organizing this wonderful gathering. I will be attending as well, and I hope to meet many of you there. OpenCon is an impressive collection of the next generation of open science thinkers. As with previous meetings, many of the ideas circulated around this three-day event will inspire PLOS to do even better, and I can't wait to share them with our team. PLOS has some long-held beliefs regarding open access. Among them, published research should be freely available to everyone, properly executed science deserves publication, and data-supported conclusions should be accessible for reproducibility. Together, all of these principles serve as the foundation for a transition to open science and a new scientific exchange. And although PLOS is 15 years old, a mere teenager in the publishing timeline, we understand the need to evolve quickly and to focus on the researcher as the center of the scientific enterprise. So today, I want to share with you some of our highlights from the past year and to give you a sneak peek into 2017 and our robust open science model. Earlier this year, PLOS launched a new manuscript submission system called Aperta. Most manuscript systems available today were built for research dissemination of print journals. With Aperta, we wanted to offer you something better, simpler, faster, a robust and modern system that can quickly adopt new innovations and adapt to ever-changing workflows. A platform with an open first mentality, with a focus on moving your manuscript through the process as quickly as possible, with a modern interface and faster time to first decision. Aperta is available to PLOS Biology now and will be rolling out soon to our other journals, including PLOS One. PLOS's first foray into preprints is our collaboration with BioArchive to enable pre-publication sharing of findings, which can be discovered, versioned, and commented on prior to formal submission. Furthermore, authors can transfer manuscript files from BioArchive directly to PLOS with a single click, saving you valuable time and effort. In the coming months, PLOS will take even bolder strides into this space to demonstrate the value of scalable early publication to researchers, funders, institutions, and ultimately to science. We are moving in the direction of ensuring that you are all recognized for your scientific contributions. PLOS is one of the original signatories to the ORCID open letter and will soon require authors to have an ORCID ID. It takes less than 10 minutes to get one and will distinguish you from other authors with similar names and allow you to receive proper credit for your research. In 2017, PLOS will be launching a number of community-led and community-managed channels that will offer research communities a new way to publish, disseminate, and discover research. We are growing the program now and welcome your suggestions for new channels. We are also expanding our Early Career Researcher Travel Award Program. This program recognizes efforts of PLOS authors in the early stages of their careers and offers opportunities for them to present their research findings to a wide audience. Please reach out to me or anyone at PLOS if you want more information on these initiatives. As a strong supporter of the ideals of OpenCon, I urge you to continue to get involved in creating the landscape that you want to see and continue to knock down barriers. PLOS was founded with the researcher foremost in our mind, and we want to work with you to continue our journey from open access to open data to open source and ultimately to open science. Thank you.